Hello everyone and welcome to Learn Tag. In this short video, I'll show to you guys how you can create an administrator account by using command prompt or CMD. The first thing that we need to do is to open CMD and for that we need to go as search and we type here CMD. Once you see command prompt, you click with the right of the mouse and then from the options that will show here, you need to choose run as administrator. You need to make sure that you are running CMD as administrator, otherwise you will not be able to run these commands that we need to create an administrator account. So we click run as administrator. You can create users also by using control panel and from control panel you go over user accounts and there you can create new accounts. But if you like CMD, then these are the commands that you need to write in order to create a new user and then make this user an administrator. The steps are pretty much the same regardless which operating system you are using. It can be Windows 11, Windows 10 or Windows 7 or whatever operating system from Windows you are using, still the commands remain the same. So first of all, let's try the command that will show us which are the users that are already created on this computer. And this command is net user. Once you write this command, you press enter. And as we can see, here are the users that are created on my computer. I'll write all the commands that you need on the description below. You just need to apply on the same way like I'm doing right now. Now, the command that we need to create a user is like this. So it's net user. And now you write the username that you want for this user. I'm just going to write admin test and then space, then slash and then add. So we write net space, then user, then space. Then you write the username. It can be whatever username that you want. It can be admin, your name, whatever. And then you write space, then slash, and then you write the command, which is add. And then you press enter. The command completed successfully. So now we have created the user admin test on my computer. But by default, this user is just a standard user. It's not an administrator user. In order to make this user an administrator, we need to write this command. So we write net, then local group, and then we write the group of the administrators, which by default should be administrators. And then we write the username that we just created, which we want to make administrator. In this case is admin test, and then we give a space, and then slash, and then we write the command add. So basically the command is like this net space local group space administrators space then the username which in my case is admin test space slash add and then we press enter this command you can use for any existing user that you have in your computer for example if you want to make the user learn tech administrator you just write the same command but you just change the username which in this case will be learn tech so basically that's all that you have to do to create a new user on a windows computer and make this user administrator to verify this we need to go at search and we write control panel once you see the app control panel you open it you view by category so we click over here view by and we choose category then we click over user accounts then once again over user accounts here and now we click over manage another account here and here we are here it is the user that i just created which is admin test and we can see here that it is an administrator account in case that you want to delete this user account from the command prompt the command that you are going to need to write is like this net user now you write the username then you press space and then you write the command delete. So net space user space, the username that you just created space slash delete. You write this command just in case that you want to delete the user that you just created or any kind of user that you want to delete. The command is the same. You just change the username. In my case, I don't want to delete. So I'm not going to press enter in order to apply this command. 
So basically that's all that I want to show to you guys. I hope that you like this video and please do not forget to subscribe. Wish to you all the best. Thank you.